all eyes on City Hall today, where the City Council is expected to override vetoes on a couple of bills the mayor says would make the city less safe. One of those bills is the so-called How Many Stops Act. This would require officers to report each time they have even a casual encounter with a civilian. Is it an unnecessary task for officers or an important step towards transparency? I would assume reporter Phil Tate, live at City Hall, with more on this debate that continues in the final hours. Phil. Yeah, good morning, Mike. And that really is the bottom line question that will be answered as in just hours, the council is expected to vote, aiming to really override the mayor's veto for the How Many Stops Act. And this is many supporters have said that this bill is all about transparency and it would change the look of policing. Well, this as it would really mandate officers to report their interactions with the public. Now, it would require officers to file a report on every single person they might stop, including millions of so-called level one encounters. Take a look at your screen right now as the police union release this video demonstrating that smartphone app nearly three minutes per report officials will be spent away from the public safety task at hand and this as the mayor believed it would only create more paperwork for officers I'm very confident that we came through this legislation with a veto proof majority of council members voting in favor of this bill so I feel very confident that we will succeed in the override they're going to determine if they're going to override my veto no matter what happened we know what we both want, both the city council and what I need for public safety and the residents of the city. And supporters are expected to rally on the steps of City Hall just ahead of this vote. Important to note, the council will need 34 votes in order to override the mayor's veto. And if they are able to do this, this will be the second time that we've seen this during the Adams administration.